Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Lies of P. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we are going to continue exploring the Abbey. But before we do, we're going to take care of a few side things. First things first, I did not realize the uh, dog guy was here in Hotel Crat. And secondly, I did go ahead and level up quite a bit. Right, there's my stats. Now the 27 and motivity and technique, the only reason I have those is because of the amulet I'm wearing. And then I did scope out uh, where we need to go for the uh, decipher. Although it's not the whistle that I need to use, it's the frozen feast weapon. So I don't know what we're supposed to do there. It took me quite a while to find where we actually had to go because it was not by the parade master. Uh, puppet or the parade puppet whatever master whatever that boss is it was not by there I ran around for a good while trying to find it I know where it's at now um, there is a merchant over there I don't think we've actually talked to him so I I didn't talk to him I didn't do anything I didn't want to mess with anything uh, so we will be going over there in just a minute but with all that being said let's go ahead and get started and the first thing we're going to do is come over here and talk to the dog guy. Hugo, I think his name is. Hey, I didn't think we'd meet again. I've just come back from the relic of Trismegistus, and I had no idea it was connected to the hotel. I should add that to my map. It was grim work out there. I found the real Aladoro. He's dead. Probably died heroically, seeking one last score. I buried his body and collected his belongings. It's a tragedy. He was a real professional and an inspiration to the next generation. I'm planning to continue his legacy. And like I said, I'm an explorer, not a fighter, so you would know. Is this weapon any good? If you're worthy, I'll give you... Aladoro's weapon. I want to give Aladoro's belongings to someone who knows their worth. It's what he would have wanted. If you can prove your worth, his weapon is yours. Okay, well, you gonna give me his weapon? Guess not. Let's go to the, where was it at? I think I started here. I think I went... No, it wasn't over here. Hold on. We need to go over by the... Uh, it's the stargazer above that. And I think I went, sorry, I'm just trying to remember which way I went. I almost ran right off this cliff side here.
pretty sure is down over there. So we should go this way. Okay, yeah, this this is the merchant that was not here. I actually uh, sifted through uh, some of my videos just to make sure we didn't find this guy, and he was not here before. Who are you? I make deals only with established clients as a rule. There's something rolling up behind us. Or not. It looked like there was something coming for us. I'm tripping, man. I'm tripping. Who are you? I make deals only with established clients as a rule. What? Why are you showing me that? That's too suspicious for me. I'm not interested in third-rate stalkers like you. Piss off. Who are you? Show the weapon. Well, I know it said something about frozen feast do we have to actually wield it who are you oh is it mr frozen feast i knew only the meeting spot not the client i apologize for not recognizing you here's the item you wanted i made it just like the uniform of that conceited stalker hope you like it looking forward to more discreet transactions if you catch my meaning Interesting. I figured we had to like, I don't know. Like I know that we had to search the ground for one and knock a thing out of a puppet for the other. I didn't realize we had to actually um, hold the weapon. It's pretty cool though. Hope you like it. Hope you like it. All right, well, that's all he does, I guess. Let's go to the most recent Stargazer, and then I'll meet everybody at the Abbey where the boss is. I'll see everybody over there. Okay. Okay. Let's, uh, grab some help. And then, I don't know, we'll keep everything the way it is for now. Yeah. And let's go fight a boss. That sword looks so badass. I want it. There's no way that this thing is going to be that easy.
Oh, ow. Please don't kill me. Oh, she's a badass. You want to come down here? Oh my god. Come on down here. That was a cool fight. That was a really cool fight.
It hurts so much. I want to be free. Please. What? What, what do we do? I, I, I don't know. I, I can't make this choice. I think she wants to live, but... What will you do? You have to decide. You, not me. Keep her alive, perhaps against her wishes, or... Or give her peace. It, it's your call. Oh, man. Let's give her peace. That's... Uh, that can't be a good way to live. Thank you. I was trapped for so long. So much torment. So much pain. Take my ergo. I will be with you to the very end. His hair turned gray. That's really sad. But at least Sophia is at peace now. did do the right thing, didn't we? I trust you. Let's keep going. <gasps> oh, okay. Freaking musketeer. Jeez.
Damn, that guy was pretty hard. I have a feeling we're getting close to the end of the game now. That is definitely an elevator that we're probably going to have to take. Oh, awesome. Got a stargazer. rest at it Oh my god, there's two of them. Come on. That was a good trap. Come on, boy. Oh, come on with these guys. It's like they always have an explodey guy or a second one of those musketeer dudes right next to each other. Quartz. How many quartz do we have now? Two quartz? We're going back down? Well, at least I know we're not backtracking because there's enemies. Two explodey boys. Yeah, come here. Come here, mofo. I feel like something's going to pop up. Oh, 
Oh, that's probably insta-death. Oh my good god. Those guys are not fun to deal with. beat the ever-living shite out of me oh you know what before we go all the way up there let's repair our weapon Please don't fall. Okay. I'm always nervous about that, man. Great. Went better than expected. Oh, I did not like that. I did not like that at all. You would think that we would have opened up that other shortcut, the one where the stargazer is. Okay, here's a uh, elevator. See which way it goes. Down. We're just talking about this shortcut too. Let's rest at the stargazer and then we will go back up here. I don't think we'll go too much further because the episodes are already getting pretty long and I don't want to keep doing real long episodes.
Oh, look who it is. At first, it was money. There was no way out of this dump other than buying your way out. Later, when his sight started failing, all we had was swallowed up by the first few treatments. He was going totally blind. But now, the fruit is useless. I swear on my life as a stalker that your father is safe. My employer promised not to harm him. Not that such a promise is worth anything to you now. But I wanted to set the record straight before, you know, revenge is all I have left now. You might be my first real challenge. Come on. I didn't want it to end this way. I suppose we villains never get to choose. Ooh, she, she was a tough fight. She was a lot tougher than her brother, that's for sure. Oh man, that poor person. Oh, here's Geppetto. It saddens me to see my precious son in a place like this. I wanted you to grow up as a good boy in a peaceful world. And yet, I think all I've taught you is blood and violence. This will be the last time I ask. I promise. Simon has gone completely mad. He's trying to become a god by using a tremendous amount of ergo. I don't know what kind of world he wants to build. Perhaps there's no stopping him. I trust you. My son. And I'm ready for any outcome. But I don't know what you think of me. Speak truthfully. For my sake. Was I a trustworthy father to you? Um. Sure. I see. I have the courage to carry on because of you. Put an end to it all and come back to your father's side. Remember the happy family we once were. We can become that again. Put an end to it all, son. I, I don't know. I don't trust Geppetto. After we learned that he started the puppet frenzy. Hopefully there is a stargazer over here. It'd be really nice. Just saying. That 
Da. Perfect. So what we'll do is we'll grab this item. And then we will end the video right here. And when we come back, we will continue on. Hopefully find Simon and kill him because he's the cause of a lot of this. So with that being said, I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, good afternoon, or good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.